point he has to green. Am I going the wrong way? Or... Looks like I am. I hope I thought it was gonna fly at me. I don't know why. Yeah, am I going to game? Yeah, I don't think I've done this. Good, good, good. Oh, and I gotta sit. It's a trap. Anything glowing down there, so I'm not gonna do it. Wait, I think I see probably not gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I know it. I knew it was nothing. I don't even know why I did that. Yeah, I shouldn't. You want to save? Ice. Nice sample. Nothing to say about that. Maybe it has to be a little chunk on the ground. You're gonna make me slip and slide. You're gonna make me slip and slide, aren't you? Kinda wanna touch it. But I kinda don't. I've died enough. I'm I'm going. There you are. Pretty much straight up water ice here in the form of huge glaciers. Easy to forget that ice is most the most common mineral on the Earth's surface. We think of it as something to drop in our drinks to keep them cool and not as an important mineral. Prince. see any danger yet. Oh, okay, never mind. Seems like I'm gonna have to do a lot.
power. I don't want to touch the fence just in case. Oh, okay, there's a hole. Oh my god, you did. I was about to be hella pissed. as bad as I thought it would be actually. Von Tam, Sloma. Yeah, I can see it's broken. Great. There go my hopes for getting off the planet. I've discovered the portal direction issues. Make it to that oxygen supply module. I discovered the portal direction used to travel between Earth and this planet, but the device is inoperable. It seems there was some kind of massive failure, so I won't be able to use the portal to return to Earth. I'm also running low on oxygen. But I believe there's another supply module several kilometers north of here. The woman is leading me in in that general direction. So, with any luck, I can make it there and charge my oxygen. But then what? First things first, I guess. Cool. For years we depended on the portal system to develop our colony on this planet. It never occurred to us that one day it would cease to function. As the native plants die and life recedes from view, the hope that we would never, we would ever return to our families in Russia faded too. It didn't happen all at once, of course. The portal faded from its former glory, glory slowly over time. The more we developed this world for our creature, creature comforts, the more desolate the environment became. Eventually, the portal began to mimic the world around us and then it fought back. At first, there were simple accidents. <clears throat> there were simple accidents in the transportation process of our supplies. We assumed it was a fluke. After all, after all, we were dealing with technology that we had only just discovered. So this was a rational conclusion at the time. Our theories were rendered inconsequential. So, when a group of colonists suffered the same fate, the shadows of, uh, of their former selves, the gore-stained arrival platform, was a horror that we could not put out of our minds. 
Moscow sent nothing more, and we were too afraid to face fate and test our luck. We are now trapped here on a dying world, a grave of our own making. He didn't clean it up. Come on. Hmm. I need to move that platform. Boink! Take another? Сейчас, беги! Осторожно! А, о, но! Гораун! Направо! Окей! I like that. Давай, давай. Стой, подожди. Сейчас. О. Oh. me. Стой, подожди! Сейчас! Стой, подожди! Сейчас! She can sense it before they attack, or направо. Okay. Давай, давай. I see how this works. Okay, I gotta say. Then I keep forgetting I have to look up if I want Max Air. Now. 
Налево. Go around, I guess. Jumpy jumps, but this time in the wind. I don't like this one bit. Wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. The longer I play, the rustier I get. Oh boy. Alright, more green footsteps. I did get the save, so why not? I'm gonna go take a look. I can't. Alright, alright, alright. Green fire is dying out, while the recent release of copper particles into the atmosphere following the explosion contributed to the stunning stunting of plant growth. It could not be the cause for the wide, widespread death we are witnessing across the entire planet. Perhaps it has something to do with the portal. The last activations were turbulent to be sure. And the flora and fauna have recently become volatile. Volatile? Even the planet's larger species are further Even the planet's larger species are far more aggressive in the aftermath of our infant interventions. I fear that we may have crossed acceptable boundaries in our experiment. We were the planets always this angry or are they simply lashing out at us for our failings? These are not theories of rational men. 
but science has yet to yield a response. I only hope it is not too late. She may yet save us all. Wasn't I supposed to find air? Ooh, can I go back now? Hold on. It was broken, right? Oh, I needed to boost up there. Right, 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 right. Not right, 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 but I just figured that out. Take the long way. Oh, oh thank goodness this is still on. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, Hopefully I don't have to put more than one. Because that would suck. Sneaking while I was busy. It springs. Oh. There has to be some kind of touch. Straight up water ice here in the form of huge glaciers. It's easy to forget that ice is the this is an it. I entered an area with unusually high geothermal activity. There is there are hot springs all around and geysers 
guys geysers shooting up out of the crust. I'm not as nimble as a, the woman climbing the rocks. She pops. I wonder if I could make use of these fountains to boost me up. My suit should protect me from the scalding hot water, but it could be quite a ride. Quite a ride! So, let's go! I don't like, don't give me puzzles with this place. I'd rather not. At all. And I almost fucked up. Beans. Why are you over here by yourself? Why is this so bright? Oh, okay, okay, going. You said my suit would protect me from the scalding hot water, did you not? I feel like I traversed this entire planet. Turn yourself. Don't fret about trivial matters. My goodness. Okay. Inferno. I'm gonna try this. But if it does. Wait, 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 wait. You want to say about this building? Can I touch it? Okay. Ooh, that's a bit toasty. Well, at least it's a dry heat. It's 
like that. It's the power. Okay, so. And. I hope that doesn't mean I walk on it. Does not mean I walk on it. Had to check. Throw a bomb on it. I fucked up. Yeah, since I was going this way, you made me a turn. Get up. Space suit. I'm not even listening to you about the space suit, dude, because you fucking told me that the water wouldn't be a problem. Tip over. Now I'm just gonna remember the way back. Isn't that nice? Oh, that was easy. Well, I didn't run past them. Oh my god. That's it. As soon as I'm out of this lava area, I am done though. It's gonna have to wait. Don't you. Last time I did that, you killed me. Where? Uh, you coughed on my left. I'm pretty sure. No fucking way. Помоги, подними. Наверх. I'm gonna drop you. Russian woman appears to have greatly modified biology. While traversing the volcanic region, she began to suffer from oxygen from my suit appeared to be of no help, and she only recovered upon intake and exhale intake of exhaled gases, including carbon dioxide. It appears her body is somehow partially photosynthetic. 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 Able to intake CO2 and convert it to oxygen like plants do on Earth. While this could explain her survival in an oxygen poor atmosphere, I can't understand the science behind this observation. 
Yeah, she's pretty far away. Hold on. Oh, you took my booze, motherfucker. Yes, please. There is nothing I can do to stop the chain reaction. Soon, this world will be lost. I cannot fathom my part in this catastrophe, or the blind arrogance with which I carried out the plan as escape. Separated from the motherland, I will never know the outcome of the great conflict between Moscow and the West. But I earnestly hope that they never stand on similar grounds and witness the destruction they have wrought, as I must. I watch as the vibrant world runs to dead rock. I so desperately wanted to hand triumph to our people. I could have been a savior, but now I cannot face them. I am glad that we can never return. Our people will never know what happened here. They will never know why their families never came home. They will never know it was my fault. They will never know you screwed up an entire planet. <laughs> Um, hit him from here. I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. But I only got one little bitty boost. Do I push? Do I push? Do I push? Did I miss something? Was I just supposed to handle the door? But there's the power thing. Maybe it's on the other side. Maybe. I'm just tripping. Oh, more power cells. Go around this way if I can. I cannot. Dang it. Oh, it calls for a precise aim. Can I just skip it? And no, don't do that. Okay. If I had missed, I would have been. I don't know. I I think I've fallen into contempt. 
like a pro. Too bad it won't tell me the buttons. Then I need to press. Unless it did, and I just haven't been paying attention. I don't think I... Maybe I can play the other Illinois. I mean, I hated editing it. It took way too long. And if I play good, I won't have to edit it. At least not that much. I probably still have to edit it. All right, the crater. Crater. How am I running fast? Didn't you just like dip off? Sorry. I thought I found Survivor today. A hand reached up from the dirt, yearning for help. When I rushed towards the charred dying flesh, it struck me deeply in my abdomen. It was a horrible remnant of our intervention. Somehow, still alive. The native life saw its revenge on me, and soon it would be victorious. I am responsible for this madness. We did not belong here. The planet did not deserve this. The distant worlds are kept from our reach because we have not yet earned the right to be there. Yet somehow I fear that when the time comes, man will seek these treasures in the heavens, not because of wonder. He will do so because he has destroyed his original nest. We are fools. Нашему большому разочарованию, экологическое воздействие нашей эксплуатации the plant the life receded rapidly. We theorized that the moss was the primary source of food for all the life on the planet. Unfortunately for our civilization here, the decrease in the moss not only meant the decrease in power, but also decrease in oxygen. Human and plant alike began to die. As luck would have it though, one of the doctors noticed an oddity, oddity, oddity in town. One of our assistants Заметил в городе нечто необъяснимое. Одна из наших сотрудниц, Айлита, разводила сад. So I uh, turn it down when I read because the voice is distracting. So I did not hear him say Айлита at all. Ее ребенок учить и поделиться своим секретом вынудил нас применить. Was keeping a garden, and it was thriving. We attempted to discover its secret, but Elita was strangely defensive. Apparently, her child had died in the early stages of the oxygen shortage. Elita refused to cooperate and share her secret. And share her secret. Forced our hand. Soldiers came threatening to burn the garden, but when Elita moved to return her plants, they grew stronger. Her touch made them react, brought them to life. Regarding, regarded then as a tool, Elita was taken from prison and forced to undergo terrible experiments. We severely altered her on a genetic level by injecting an abundance of, the na of native DNA into our body from we severely altered her on a genetic level by injecting an abundance of native DNA into our body from the preserved moss cultures. While she roared, while she roared in pain, in protest, we took her humanity away.
on a molecular 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 level. Elita was more of a plant than a human when we were finished. Her eyes looked on a brilliant green color and her lungs filled with CO2, but it was a success. Her footsteps invigorated the ground in her wake with small sprouts of life. The moss responded to her touch, rising up from the dust. I did not expect Elita to forgive us, but she is the only hope to restore the balance of life to this world. Without Elita, this planet will remain in decay for the rest of time. Well, at least, uh, we got her story. She's human. Some jumpy jumps. Okay. Now where did she run off to? Oh hi. What are you doing? Okay, I'm heading towards the light. You okay? Wait, so she was speaking Russian, but the translator was supposed to work on her, right? Translate, translator was supposed to translate what she was saying, if she was Russian. Am I not wrong? Hey, let death ensue. Wait, 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 I wasn't ready! Putting me here. Like, on purpose. I don't think I'm supposed to go this way anymore. Let's go down there. See what's in the middle of all this, uh. Else. I don't know. I'm just I'm just trying to get through the game. I don't like limited mobility at all. Oh. Slide. Just slide. Just slide. Just slide. Just slide. Just slide down. Just slide. Yeah, mm hmm Carefully, carefully, carefully. Oh. Thought it was a C4. Or dynamite. Stop. Initial analysis of the meteor indicates non-typical terrestrial meteors. Upon further investigation, the meteor appears to be part of a highly engineered vehicle. Our current theory is that the crater was the landing site for the advanced race that built the portals and related power structures. We set up a research outpost on the rim of the crater, and we plan to study the site at least through next winter. Let's see what's on the ground. They're not bones. They're not footprints. Pretty weird if you ask me.
I am not likely to see another day. The wound I carry the wounds I carry are a constant reminder of the pain that we inflicted on this planet. Our original purpose here we were pure and good. But maybe that is the curse of a species far from home. We cannot adapt, so we destroy. Instead of cultivating, we upset the natural order of the new world. It has always been this way and always was, with, will be such. And there are, there is the arrogance to think it should be any different for our generation. I'm sorry, Yolita. I did not see until it was too late. If my name is ever again called to mind, I hope it will be as a lesson for those who come after me. Do. I'm, I'm not even going to try that one. I'm sorry. I did click. Oh. I'm again. I'm, I'm, I'm guessing. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I'm gonna go the long way. Yeah, Wait, was that storm there before? What's up there? I, I think I would have noticed. Maybe. I don't think that was there before. Let me see, let me see, let me see. I wonder if there's a rock over there I need to pick up, but... I might be able to make this. What's the worst that can happen? Alright, well, that's that. I mean, you could have done all this yourself, to tell you the truth. I'm not gonna make that. I ain't even gonna try.